Servus Freunde, my name is Jimmy Cage. And I'm Dennis, the Buddy Meister. Welcome back to a brand new episode of Favorite Song Reactions, the segment where I show some of my favorite songs to the Busy Meister. Today we continue with our tradition of songs from a special Hindi movie. Ah, whom? Uh, okay, yeah, you say it. Not whom, it's Ham. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Ham Abke Hai Korn. Korn. Yeah. H A H K. Mm -hmm. Easier. And I think it's already the fifth song that I show you. Mm -hmm. Once again, it's a Hindi language musical romantic drama, a big family movie, a Bollywood super hit from 1994, written and directed by Suraj Bajatya. Stars. Um, Salman Khan. Yes. And Madhuri Dixit. Perfect. That's enough. Yeah. As Prem and Nisha, <laughs> it's uh, three and a half hours long, song after song after song. I, I use the same notes uh, every yeah, time. Yeah. And the soundtrack was composed by Ram Lakshman. And the song I show you today is titled Babul Jo Dumne Sikhaya, or simply Babul. And uh, lyrics by Ravinda Raval. And this is the only song in the entire movie that's sung by Sharda Sinha. I think, except uh, aside from this song, everything with a female voice is Lata Mangeshka. Mm -hmm. But this one is Sharda Sinha. And it's coming right after the shoe song. So you already know the shoe song. It's the one I showed right you. after. So they're right after talking. There's, no, no talking. Okay. It's kind of bizarre. There's okay. the song ends, and then silence, and then this song starts. All so right. if you remember, the shoe song is at the beginning of one of the wedding rituals, yep. and uh, now you get this song. So I think we should just go into it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so where do I have it? All right. No, that's, that's something else. Something else. This is it. <laughs> they are the shoes. Interesting though that they, that's another singer. Yeah. yeah. Why? I don't know. The dog was there. Yes. I forgot his name. Fluffy? <laughs> I don't know. His name is Fluffy? No, I don't know. Thank you. 
Oh. To be continued. <sighs> yeah, step by step, you are going through Watching the movie. Watching the movie, yeah. more or less. <laughs> um... A yeah, very different. We have, to, we have to be honest with the with the with the people who watch this this video. Okay. Right before recording, you told me what did you say? You say you said something like, yeah, maybe this is not going to be like the best song and something. Yeah. Yeah. yeah what yeah. I meant with that is it's not as exciting. Yeah. Yeah. Or as upbeat. and it actually isn't as exciting because yeah. it of course hasn't like this big choreography and it's not a ten minute party festival song <laughs> yeah and it, it's like you said it's not sung by lata mangeshkar it's a very different voice it's mm. almost a little bit um, like um strange to hear this voice because this is like someone i've never heard before mm. probably and it's very it's a very special voice but i like the melody very much mm. yeah and uh, I think it works very well in this situation. A situation that we've seen in many, many movies where the bride, the daughter leaves the house and yeah. it's always very it's the it's the one thing that's then that's always very serious after all the yeah. after all the the festivities. Yeah. The moment where the daughter has to leave the house and everybody's crying and but you can't get out of the situation. And I think it's a very it's a beautiful song. It's a beautiful song. And I like I like the melody. I like the the ways the, the melody the melody takes mm. and um, it's strange but i kind of maybe because of the fact that it isn't sung by lata Mageshka, i was like paying a little bit more attention to uh, the, the melody mm -hmm. and it it, it, it um, sounded to be very difficult to sing like because of all these twists yeah. and turns that yeah. the music yeah. takes yeah Beautifully said, but okay. Master. Yeah, thanks. I'm really impressed once again. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> no, but yeah. yeah, it's really a really heartfelt song, and uh, like I said, it's coming directly after the shoes song, mm -hmm. and uh, it's such a break. But uh, when I watched it, I was kind of perplexed that there wasn't uh, a, a passage with uh, no songs, with just dialogue and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. But now thinking about it, it totally fits because it. Uh, emphasizes that break that mm -hmm. she now yeah. has to yeah. leave the house and um, it's also something before we be began to watch Indian movies I had no idea about uh, Hinduism and uh, wedding ceremonies yep. and stuff like that so it was totally new for me that it's a common custom that mm -hmm. the wife has to leave the family behind and moves in with the husband of course that's you assume that's happening yeah. but i didn't know that they live at the house of the husband's family so mm -hmm. this whole mm -hmm. joint family um thing is for for us foreigners yeah. very uh yeah foreign yeah <laughs> and, yeah and uh yeah songs like this totally emphasize like how big of a change that must be in the life of a, of a young woman and uh, yeah yeah it's almost it's almost like a of course there's something in most cases, something beautiful like happening now and in the future, but it's also like probably a little bit traumatic, of mm. course, yeah, because this is like from the moment you were celebrating and having all the fun, and like in the next second there is like like this, mm. and next day everything is different, yeah. yeah. So that's probably yeah, like very very hard situation to, yeah. to cope with, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think five songs in. There are how many are there? Fourteen? There something? are fourteen, but um, I watched the shorter version of the movie, which is also three hours and thirty minutes, I think. And in that version, there are twelve songs. I think they cut two songs mm -hmm. for the theatrical version, which is what I, what I watched. But I think uh, in India, everyone knows the longer version with fourteen songs. So I think I think I will show you the twelve songs. And then probably as a bonus round, I show you the two other songs. The, the two songs they cut are really not that important for the story. Okay. One is, I think, uh, about ice cream or <laughs> some sweets. And one is about Fluffy the dog. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember his name. I have no idea. I will look okay. it up for the next okay, time. Yeah. yeah, so that was uh, our reaction to this uh, song, Babul. And yeah, you can hit me up on Twitter, Instagram, Redbox, and also on Patreon simply at the Jimmy Cage. And you can hit and you and you, and you can hit me up on Where? Twitter on Twitter yeah. at the Bodymeister. Perfect. 
And if you enjoyed this reaction, <laughs> please give us a thumbs up, share, subscribe, whatever you like. And make sure you hit that bell for all we have to tell. So sounded like I'm drunk again, but I'm not, I swear. Really? Thank <music> you.